guys from Kyrgyzstan, from Jalalabad. So now we're gonna discover the market and the life here. So today we're gonna make a tour in Jalalabad. Bye bye. <laughs> here you can communicate salam, or as well you can say kharasho, because kharasho that means hello in Russian. I think we can salam. So nice people. What was this? They eat the stone here. Wow. <laughs> Ah! Eat? 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 Eh? You want to try? Okay. This or this? Which one is? But there is a small? Salam. This one? Salam. It's a dish salam. This one? Eh? Okay. Small stone today, I will eat? Yeah. Okay, guys. Let's take. Let's give a try. Hmm? Are Huh? For you. For me? Hadarka. Ah, dengi minada. No, 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 Say Bismillah. <laughs> Bismillah. Guys, today I'm gonna eat stone. For the first time. No, it's good. Really? It's not strong, it's good. Hmm? <laughs> it's good. It's really good. I was thinking this is uh, like uh, hard. It's not hard. Huh? Ooh. Mmm, so delicious. <laughs> delicious, delicious. It's really easy. I can finish it all. I think I can put my mouth. <laughs> not that much. <laughs> not that much. I think tomorrow we will have cement. <laughs> cement work. Guys, I'm eating. <laughs> I'm eating stones here in Kyrgyzstan. <laughs> Try. It's your turn now. Oh. How do you feel? It's salty. Salty? Did you mm. it's sticky. Sticky, right? Eh? Mm, it's sticky. How much? Nearly, Ati. I don't know how much it is. Ati, me. Musa, Musa, was good. I don't want. I want to give it to her. Take this. I will keep it. 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 Okay, Rahmat Mum. Rahmat Salam. Thank you. So good, woman. So good, so good, so good. Wow. It reminds me of my grandmother. It really, it reminds me of my grand. Hello. <laughs> I feel like I remember my grandmother really so much. Really. I remember Haruza. Yeah. She, she, kissed, she kissed your hand. You kissed my hand. Oh, so good, woman. Please, guys, whoever from Kyrgyzstan, go and buy from her. Please, please, please. Whoever visit, come to the Shalal Abed and buy from her. So, honey, how was your experience? Uh, it was very salty. It was good. It was some kind of different taste. I liked it. It's like a salty cheese. Mm. Uh, it's like cheese. Yeah, it was cheese. It's something like that cheese. I don't know how come, but it really tastes like cheese. But guys, people here in Kyrgyzstan, they eat stones. They eat stones. There is a famous story, like the woman when she gets pregnant, she wants to eat the stones here in Kyrgyzstan. I hear about it, not sure it's true or no. But so that's why since that time as well, they are giving like a, a, the stones, they sell it, not even, they sell it. And this really tastes different. Uh, this place actually, Jalal Abad, not many people they know about it and not many people they come. But I think if you want to experience like a local life, must visit is the third biggest city in Kyrgyzstan, Bishkek, Osh and Jalal Abad. See people here, they come, they bring their vegetable, start selling. Did you ever visit the vegetable market that is quiet as well here in Kyrgyzstan? So quiet, few people only. Is, is it normal like this? Why? What are they? <laughs> the population of Kyrgyzstan is not that much high, it's few people. 
food you have to cross from that side so we're gonna go so you can have some food uh, Kyrgyzstan their food is different they don't put too much like a thank you they don't put too much like a powders and they put like a chili or something so their food is mostly too much light <laughs> See here, this is the life in Jalal Abed. There is ice cream shops. I was thinking, where have you been? <laughs> I was thinking, where have you been? And later I saw that uh, you went to help the lady. Salam. Think a kebab, you can have a meat and this. We will take the kebab and uh, what's this? This one I'll take. This? We are sitting in this uh, local restaurant, we will have some food. They are famous here a lot with the kebab, same like Turkey. Turkey, they like too much kebab. So now we're gonna eat and try, is it really delicious or no? We tried it in Turkey, it was so delicious and perfect, well cooked. Here now we will compare, because as well they're affected with the culture of Turkey, they're affected. Guys, look at this. This is the tea for them, look how... Oh. <laughs> As honey said, Japanese style. Mm -hmm. So guys, this one they call it uh, like uh, samosa here. So and uh, oh, this is chili. They like like this pudding chili. This there is a meat inside, and that's the kebab. We took it. You have to take it like this. Oh, delicious. There is water. You. There is a meat. Best kebab at the Turkian. Mm, delicious. In this country, by the way, everything is meat. Even salad, I think they make it with meat. They like too much meat, too much. So. And onion. Meat and onion, yes. See, I will show you how much they give onion. Look at this. And look there. <laughs> so, meat and onion is the mass things here in Kyrgyzstan to make you strong. Now it's kebab time. Ta -da! I will eat. <laughs> mm, nice. Delicious. Mm. Wow. So, guys, this is 120 some kirgi some each piece. And this one, 100. See, I'm not sure how much I did check. So, guys, we enjoyed our food. Now we came here to have a round. <laughs> Honey, make friends. <laughs> hey. I bring you always to the local life. Here uh, there is a market for clothes, for uh, everything. Here there is a meat shop. Even in this market, can you believe there is a meat shop? These people, they really adore meat and bread. This bread is so good. Uh, it's a homemade, of course. <laughs> the bread, it's uh, something so important for the Kyrgyz people. Like they like eating bread. See how they make it. It's must like every home to eat the bread with uh, their uh, sauce or and with the meat. Meat, meat, meat. This must. As you can see as well, many women they come here, they bring their things. Uh, I think they cook it in the home, not sure. But many women are standing and they are the ones who are selling this, which is so nice. People are so good, friendly. Even we cannot communicate with each other, still we communicate with hands and it works. So famous of nuts. So they like eating nuts. So delicious. Hello. <laughs> so nice. How yeah. much this one? How much? Price? Ah, 200. 200. So nice. Thank so beautiful. Thank you. Hello. This is a Kirgi cap. You see it actually as well as Pakistan and this. So this is a, like a Central Asia people. They wear this kind of cap. It's so uh, hot because here it's too cold in winter. So most of the people you see them with this traditional cap. So guys, welcome to Kyrgyzstan. New adventure, new experience. You have to cross. It's a uh, many... Uh, Teenagers as well in this side in the market, not like uh, in uh, Bishkek. Uh, mostly you see old people. <laughs> people are so friendly, so good. And this is the area. Hello. <laughs> so you can get some ice cream, honey. Let's buy ice cream. This is a shop here in the market. There is a ice cream. There is a 
juice. Let's have some ice cream. Salam. How are you? Ice cream? Thank you. Uh, what do you have to drink? Ice cream is here. Let me check. Ah, honey, what you are taking? You have to finish it. It's so huge. One second. No, this is the small one. Ah, okay. <laughs> I was thinking that one. Water? Dada. Why water? Uh, normal. Okay. This is no gas, huh? No gas. This gas. This gas. Bis. Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> no guess. Thank you, sir. Akuda? Akuda. Pakistani ra? India? India. Arabic? Tunisia? You know Tunisia? Tunisia? Tunisia. Tunisia. Ah. Hmm. Uzbekistan. Ah. Nice. This is a. Uh, this is Ashra. Oh, this is this. This is this, this, which is in Hindi. Salam. Hi, <laughs> honey as well. Juice. I'm sure, this one chicken. By the way, the chicken here is so less. Like uh, they, you don't see too much. Mostly meat. As you can see, the meat, 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 meat. Everywhere. Salam. Here in Kyrgyzstan, it's full of Pakistani people. They come here, the majority, more than India or this. So Pakistani, they come to study, by, to study in the university because there is many universities here. So they come, they study or they do some uh, works as well because it's near to them here. So be, by the borders. So that's why uh, many Pakistanis, they come here to work and to study. You see majority here in Jalalabad, in Uzbeki which is Uzbekistani and uh, Turkish as well, mixed Russian, majority so in Bishkek, I didn't saw here the sides. Hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and comment and share and see you in next video bye -bye. for another series of Kyrgyzstan. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>